The Swashfine Borer is a terrible pest that can quickly destroy your pumpkin and swash plants. So in this video, I'm going to share with you some of the best varieties that you can grow that have a better chance at growing pumpkin and swash. I'm also going to give you some prevention tips too, so let's garden on. Before we get into the first variety that is resistant to the swash vine borer, we want to be sure that we're not growing in the same area that we did last year. This includes any member of the cucurbits family. So this includes swash, cucumbers, and melons. So just be sure that you're rotating your crops every year so you're preventing things like disease and pests. You don't want to return to that same area of the garden until three years has passed. The first variety that is resistant to the swash vine borer are butternut swash and butternut type swash. Last year I grew some butternut type swash and had a really good harvest rate with my crop. But I still had some swash vine borer in my crop, so you're never gonna have a variety that is 100% resistant. So you're always gonna have some pests no matter what you do. So this year I'm going to be trying to grow some cheese pumpkins. These are another variety of squash that is resistant to the squash vine borer. So we'll see how resistant it is, but there are some prevention tips that you can use to help along with these resistant varieties. The first tip I have is to use some aluminum foil. So in the beginning of summer, you wanna be sure to wrap the base of the plant with aluminum foil. This is going to prevent the squash vine borer from laying eggs at the base of the stem, which will quickly kill the plant. You still might have some eggs laid throughout the rest of the vine, but the crop probably will survive. Another thing you can do is inject BT directly into the stem. This will prevent the squash vine borer from killing and laying its eggs too. So it will still lay its egg, but once the worm eats the first bit of the stem, it will quickly die. All right guys, so those were a couple varieties that are resistant to the squash vine borer and some prevention tips that you guys can use to prevent this squash vine borer and have a better success rate at growing swash. So if you guys like this video, please give it a like. And if you found any information in it helpful, please consider subscribing and again, liking the video. Thanks for watching.